hey you guys welcome back to my channel so if you guys already know my name is Belle so in today's video as you guys can tell by the title I am going to be cutting my hair well I'm gonna be doing the big chop because my hair is so damaged guys I want to give you guys a timeline of my hair but then again I kind of don't because honestly I don't even know what like what really goes on with my hair as you guys can like tell just a couple months ago i was wearing my hair natural for a while and i was just like slicking it down and pretty much gelling it down i don't know if that's what damaged my hair um i do texturize my hair because my hair is super nappy um right now it's kind of like i don't know it's kind of calm right now i guess you could say because it's usually super coarse and nappy like you can't even put your fingers through it i did just condition my hair and whatever whatnot but my hair is super damaged guys like if you guys can tell the front of my hair is obviously the longer part maybe probably the healthier part because this is probably where my hair is like kind of trying to flourish but not really but yeah this is my hair like naturally it, it hasn't been texturized i honestly don't know what type of hair i have if you guys can tell like if you guys are like you know hair specialists tell me down in the comments what kind of hair you think i have i'll probably look it up too obviously but if you're like a naturalista comment below what type of hair you hair pattern you think i have and then comment what type of hair pattern you have but yeah my hair is just super damaged um the back the back of my hair is just so damaged and short um it's a lot of dead ends i can't remember the last time i actually cut my ends off too because it's been braided up in wigs and braids and weaves and just all that other bullshit i've neglected going to pretty much a hair salon getting my hair trimmed as much as i should um just doing what you're supposed to do to take care of your hair i've just not been doing it so i just figured i cut all this off um i want it cut pretty low but i want to still be able to catch a braid with it because obviously i'm gonna have my hair braided up while i'm waiting for it to grow i'm not really gonna fuck with it um too much um but yeah this is what's going on my hair was very healthy in high school it was very healthy even after high school um i just i had gotten a perm like the infamous perm that everybody's always saying they got i really got a perm though because my hair was so coarse and i'm super tender headed right now i don't even know what state my hair is in right now because i haven't had a texturizer since probably december so it's definitely grown out but um it's just still damaged like it's still damaged and yeah i just don't know what's going on like like this makes no sense so yeah i am gonna cut this off guys i'm kind of nervous i've never done like a big chop before but um it needs to go i want to start off fresh as you guys know i'm moving to atlanta um and i want to have a fresh start with everything so i'm going to actually um make the appointment now i'm kind of tempted to just cut it myself because I watch a lot of videos before I even do anything just to make sure like you know I know what I'm getting myself into but um I watched the video and I'm like should I cut it myself because this one girl cut it herself because she wanted to feel like more in control of the scissors you know to know exactly what she's cutting off you know because sometimes you go to hair salon you'd be like okay I want a big chop I want to cut but I don't want to be bald you end up leaving with a twig on your head I'm not going to be looking crazy because I still obviously want to figure out how I can work with it because I like having my hair out honestly that's why I wanted to get this done because I like wearing my hair out I like being able to walk outside and just have my hair out but I can't with this you see this do you see this and it's like all the around the perimeter of my head no part of my head is even so yeah I need to get this hair back right because your girl's not about to be walking around looking like a bald-headed scallywag like no so yeah I'm gonna check in with you guys when we are at the hair salon don't forget to make sure that you like comment and subscribe to my video and yeah let's cut this hair off guys I'm so nervous okay guys so it's the big day um I just co-washed my hair because um I'm extremely tender-headed and I wasn't trying to look a fool over there because I will cry like I literally will cry so I just co-wash my hair I recommend that 
if you are getting your hair cut or just even getting your hair done in general like just so you don't make a fool of yourself with the hair salon just detangle or co-wash your hair or both it obviously softens your hair so i won't be in there crying because my hair is way softer and she won't be pulling out a bunch of knots because the other day girl oh, my hair was looking crazy okay there were knots on knots like and i just literally was letting it sit there that's how you know i just was not taking care of my hair but yeah so today is a big day we are about to stop at starbucks first because i'm a little it's 8 30 i don't have to be there till 10 25 so um i'm going to stop at starbucks and get something to drink and then um going and i honestly am scared because i was telling my mom last night and she's like oh my god why are you cutting off your hair like my mom one of the people who lets hair define her so um she doesn't want me to go through with this but i need to go through with this because like come on like i don't have any hair texture right now it's just i need i need a revamp so we're gonna cut this hair down and see where it goes but i don't know my hair feels a lot manageable now since I've just been like, cause I co-washed it last week, but um, I don't know. It's like softer now that it's co-washed. Anyways, I'm not about to be thinking. I'm not about to try and convince myself to keep my hair. Like we're not doing that. So, anyways, we're gonna go to Starbucks, and then after Starbucks, we're gonna go get my hair cut. So I'll check back in with you guys when we get to the salon. This is how my hair looks um so i was really thinking that she was gonna end up cutting it shorter but she told me that my like my new growth was like you know long enough to not really have to cut it so short and do the big chop so this is how my hair looks i'm already sweating and sweating this shit out but yeah your girl is healthy again and i really hope i can maintain this but this is like cut so perfectly i feel like i'll be able to keep up with this like i really do your, your girl got the bobbiana going on baby i just can't wait to see how my hair is gonna look once i really started taking care of it i did use that um oil when i got home the glam room oil that i showed you guys in my like two vlogs ago yeah it's supposed to help with hair growth and yeah i really do advise anyone who's just thinking about cutting their hair doing the big chop or even just cutting it because honestly you, your hair might not even be as damaged as you think it is i honestly thought she was gonna have to cut my hair up to here and i was just gonna have to start like all over again but she like specializes in the natural hair and she pretty much told me like my hair is good like it's not good but it's it's damaged but it's damaged to the point where it can be fixed to where i don't have to go so extreme to the big chop so this is what we got going on here this is the back i'll show you guys the back okay and i honestly love this look like i feel like um i don't know i feel like a school teacher miss bell mm -hmm. Curve. but i hope you guys enjoyed this video i wish you the best of luck in any hair journey that you're considering doing girl do it okay do not second guess because honestly this morning i was really about to be like you know what i could just wash my hair myself and call it a day but you know what I took my ass to get my hair done and I'm honestly so glad that I did. I made the right decision and don't second guess it. Like if you need, if something's gotta go, let it go. That hair, that nigga, 
whatever let it go okay girls so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to make sure that you like comment subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video bye